Sunday, the, my third day off of the week. So, yeah. so telling you, hi all of y'all. This is Gil, and I'm just going to share with you today the recent purchase I made, and this is something I paid 20 bucks for, and I'm actually using it right now, the camcorder. This camcorder right now, I'm just going to show it on the mirror right now. And this one. This camcorder is like the one that I used to have back in 2005 when I bought it brand new in 2005. It's a mini DV. <clears throat> See this camcorder right here, I bought it. So, <clears throat> so right here, I mean, this is the camcorder right here. This was what was advertised. And apparently it did not come with a charger or anything, but I already had it. I already had the charger from, because I have another camcorder like this one, but it doesn't work. So, I mean, well, it works, but, but it's like the pinch roller is missing on that one, so I can't play tapes. And so this one, this, this is the camcorder I'm using right now. It was a little finicky at first. Telling you, yeah, this one was it, it worked finically at first, but then it, it was um, but then I got it to work. I mean, it, well, it was working because they said that this person said, um, that um, it was like he had it on, he stored it, they stored it in the closet for years, don't no longer use it, but apparently, there's no charger, apparently, it didn't have a charger, but I mean. Anyway, <clears throat> not tested, so they sold it as parts. So I decided to take a chance on it, but it's not like I took a chance. I kind of wanted it, whether it worked or not. I mean, well, if I saw that it turned on, I wanted it because a lot of times we could um fix things. Yeah. So anyway, um. <clears throat> And then along the way, I also bought some cassettes. I bought these used cassettes. I was actually particularly looking for used ones, <clears throat> used on video cassettes. <clears throat> I was actually particularly looking for you. This is mini DVs used, and apparently you could tell, you can already see that they have stuff on it. That's I wanted these cassettes because they have stuff on it. I mean, they have videos on it, obviously, home videos. And so what I want to do, I want to explore other people's lives, you know, since they're giving these away or they're selling them like this. So figure, I mean, it's a way of exploring other people's lives, you know, like. And then I bought two sets of those. This is another set I bought. And I'm going to be waiting for them in the mail. So they may look, but not see. Yeah. But not see, this one obviously has stuff on it. So I'm, I'm, I'm interested to see what's in them, you know, what type of stuff is in these tapes. And right now I'm using my Allura 80 camcorder right now, so yeah. Hello everybody, well this is me again, but I'm now using my phone for the video to review this camcorder that I bought the other day, like a week ago or so. <clears throat> this is a mini DV camcorder, it uses these small cassettes, and as you saw it on the video, I, I bought a bunch of these right now used. Like that have content on them already because it interests me to to see what other people's lives looked like like in their past, you know. So I mean, and now I'll, I'll be sharing you those videos as well. I'll be uploading some of them, you know, like other people's videos since they're giving them away, right? Or they're selling them to me. So I mean, yeah, I mean. I don't know if they actually own the tapes or if they just, or if someone just gave them away in the thrift stores. And a lot of people do that, you know, like 
it's too bad that a lot of people do that, you know, that they give them away without realizing the value of those things, you know, like, and so anyway, this camcorder, <coughs> this is a Canon Allura 80, and these came out around the middle 2000s, and I, I bought one exactly like this one back in um, 2005, and I paid $5.99 at the time for it. So this one, it had a little screen, and when you turn it on, so you turn it on, and see the, there's a display right there. Right now it's set up to widescreen, but I mean, like I sound, well, I, when I had this camcorder, I always set it to widescreen, because it's better, that way, because that's like the new stuff, the new technology, and then there's all the, switches there and then it had a little SD card input but it's we don't use SD cards to record the the stuff we could make a video on it but it would be like 320 pixels by 100 200 or 120 or something like that and we could take pictures back in the day they used to advertise these camcorders like to be able to take a picture snapshot on one of these memory cards you know well with this phone I could do that I mean now in today's times I'm taking pictures of this right now using my phone like at the same time as recording so <clears throat> so I'm gonna show you how the tape looks so this is See, I'm re this is a tape I just recorded on right now and that you guys are watching right now. So, see these, um, camp. So I paid 20 bucks for this. $20 for it. I mean, it works. I mean, it works well, but it's not all, it doesn't always score that way. I mean, like when you buy something. I mean, they well, cause they they did not test it. You know, when you buy something that that they had not tested, I mean, a lot of times they work. You know, a lot of times they do work. You know, because a lot of times sellers will sell something. A lot of times sellers will sell something, but but they don't have a way of testing it because they don't have cassettes or they don't have a charger or things like that. You know, so and then. A lot, of, a lot of times when I buy these untested items and when I look at the pictures and if I see that it's in good condition physically, like, like uh, yeah, how we call it, like cosmetically in good condition, a lot of times they work, you know, they do work a lot of times. I have to say that, I mean, <clears throat> well, it depends on, on the camcorder, though, I mean, because certain electronic items like they're they're really bad they get bad with age like with the with the little capacitors or caper what do we call those capacitors because they get worn out or they get deteriorated over time with some of the with certain brands or certain years of these products but this one apparently is not one of those with with um deteriorating capacitors you know so from my experience you know, all of these that I bought that that um that they said that they could not test. Now they they often do work, you know. They, they often do, or at least like certain camcorders though. But for my CPR two fifty, the VHS, pretty much every one of those that I bought as parts only, I was able to fix them all. I was able to fix all of them. I mean every one of them. And they they're all rubber bands or they're just little things that needed to be tuned up, and yeah, that's my experience, so. But some camcorders that I know that I've had experience with, um, whether they're good or not, I mean, it's the, it's certain ones, particularly the Sony's, that are built, like, in the early 90s to the mid-90s. Those, those um, got, they're bad. They're bad camcorders because the capacitors in them, you know, they... They they used a bad material to make those camcorders. So from my experience, like the early '90s, like certain the certain camcorders, like from um, pre-1995, that they're, they're not really good. I mean, because 
some of them anyway. Well, anyway, well, I hope you liked this video of my review of this camcorder. <clears throat> so, yeah, see, I'm watching a, um, a, a Jesus movie. I'm watching this right now. These kind of things are fun to watch. I like to watch these things. So, yeah. And it's in the garage. So, yeah. Anyway. <clears throat> My Mercury's out here. So, anyways, I'm just enjoying life. I'm, this is my third day of the week off. I'm, I'm typically, <clears throat> I typically been having three days off lately. Well, Friday off. I, I, I typically been getting Fridays off. So, yeah, I mean, but I, I went to the dentist again to, to get my other set of crowns because I needed to get new two. I got four crowns total in the last month or two. So, yeah, I mean, got to keep my look, I guess. I mean, yeah, that's basically it because I want to keep my looks. You know what I mean? I guess. Why not? I mean, I have the money, so, I mean. Anyways, <clears throat> there's life in the new house, and we've been in this house for about a year old now. We've been here almost a year now. I mean, it's almost a year that we've been here. So this is life in the San Bernardino hood. Yeah. The San Bernardino hood right here. Where, where I'm, I'm at. So yeah, we live in San Bernardino. So yeah. So yeah. <clears throat> and then... So with this car, it's like I um I replaced the, the probably might have said in another video, but I know I replaced the PCV valve on this car, and since then it hasn't been eating any oil. It hasn't been eating oil. Like, it was eating oil. I mean, it was eating a lot. I mean, but you know, because I was having to add a quart every thousand miles or so. But ever since I replaced the PCV valve, I, it's been under under control now. So right now, it seems like it lost a half a quart after like 1,200 miles now. So, I mean, it's been good. And so this car, this RAV4, I mean, when they told me that it eats oil too, but I mean, so I replaced the PCV valve and I'm going to see how it goes, you know. So, yeah, I'm going to see how it goes. So, all right, I guess I'm going to get going. Hope you liked this video. Alright, see you on the next video.